<laughs> I didn't want to torture everybody today. So, everybody, <laughs> I hope you all had a wonderful evening, and I hope you all got to see the new booster shirts that are out featuring our very special um, animal. <laughs> animal. Animal. <laughs> yeah. Um, remember, this is a quick booster. You got 13 days left to order your shirt in order to get it in time for Christmas. Yay. Um, Kevin's going to be doing some work upstairs today. Um, we're having a problem with Megan's toilet. So we got to get that fixed while he's up there doing that. I'm going to be doing some cleaning. Uh, meanwhile, he's going to just tear the toilet apart. Um, and then while he runs to the store and stuff, I'll just, just be doing some work. Yay. God, that was an awfully long good morning. Yeah, really? Just about a minute and a half. Really? Yeah, Seems but like you haven't said a hi to me yet. Seemed like it took me forever to get through. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. So, how's that for a plan? Ruby, man. Yeah? We gotta get the kitchen floor done, though, because, you uh, know... I'll work on it, but the toilet upstairs leaking, so I gotta fix it. I know, but we got to get the kitchen floor down. We are having Thanksgiving dinner here. I got to put my kitchen back together. What my my oven is in my living room. <clears throat> it's all conveniently located. You don't even have to get up. You can cook right there. Um, except there's no gas hookup to it. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> Crazy man, crazy man. This place is always such a huge mess when I, I have to clear a floor, so. I know, and it drives me insane. Okay. Ah. Not, not, not a very long trip, is it? To drive. I've been married to you for ten years. I am like <laughs> right on the edge. <laughs> All right, so I'm in Megan's bathroom. Uh, upstairs. We don't come up here very often since she's uh, been away at college. We only come up to feed the animals and so we don't come into this bathroom very often. But when the main bills came, uh, they told us the toilet was leaking and I thought, oh, a little bit of puddle on the floor. But uh, it's actually quite a leak. <clears throat> so I need to uh, turn the water off here. And it's not leaking continuously, which is a good thing, but it, um, I, it seems to be the seal is out between the tank and the toilet. As you can see, when it uh, flushes, it's quite a deluge, so the, the grommet in here, the, the gasket, needs to be replaced. Okay, so there's three bolts holding this tank to the uh, toilet, so i got to work on these get the whole tank off. Okay, so I got that off. Um, it uh, wasn't too bad. So all I need to do now is pull the tank. And here we go. And there it is. Okay, so this is what's leaking. And I have to remove the entire rig here to get that off. I have to replace the whole stem. So it's two and a half inch opening and I I don't think I'm gonna find a, a grommet like that that's perfectly spread for the holes. I think you have to buy washers that are uh, independent of the grommet nowadays. So yeah and nobody painted behind the toilet when we painted the room. So that's what that looks like. I wonder if I have a little extra uh, of this um, russet color, maybe I can finish that off before I put the toilet back on. Okay, off to the store again. I need to get parts for the upstairs commode. I hope I have no problems with that. Shouldn't. So hopefully I can get the uh, bathroom finished today and get more of the floor done. 
and uh, and today's Monday. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to seal tomorrow so I can get the stuff back in on Wednesday. Lots and lots of work just to make a dead bird. Okay, so um, I managed to get a Kohler kit for the uh, tank gasket, so it's exactly the same size, which is uh, awesome. Okay, so I put a little CLR around the top of the toilet where the grommet goes. I should say the uh, gasket and uh, if you don't have um, CLR use vinegar because CLR is mostly vinegar anyway and I'll let that sit for a while and work on putting the gasket on the tank This is a flush valve and a flapper and it just goes inside the tank. It has its own gasket and you just tighten this down. It's all made out of plastic which is I think is great. So the old setup had the, uh, the tubing going through a um, clip it clips to the side. This new one has a thing on top where the tube just presses in. It's kind of neat. Took me a few seconds to figure it out. All right, so I still have the color that we painted this in. And uh, I got a little one of those disposable brushes or uh, rollers. There's actually some wallpaper on here. I want to scrape that off, clean the wall, and I will paint that before I put this back together. There you go. Okay, so we have our holes lined up and these are the bolts that came with and they're plastic coated which is kind of cool so it's not going to rust in here and I just got to get these through. Okay, so I have tightened all the bolts. It's a, uh, you make sure you don't tighten it too much. You don't want to break the ceramic bowl. And uh, I need to put the flapper on and fill it with water. I've already reattached the water supply. Okay, so here's the, the hard part, making sure that the chain is long enough to pull it and not so long that the pressure of the water won't allow you to pull it up. So let me work on that. All right, I think that's a good length. And the only way to really tell is to turn on the water. So I adjusted it, and there it is, perfect length. No leaks. So I've done my job. Just got to clean up. It's always the most unpleasant part of the whole thing, just clean up. How's it going, honey? Hi. Almost done, I have to grout the edges around the cabinets, which are the parts I hate the most. Well, do you want to see what I've been doing? Sure. <sighs> I've done all the decorating up on the two shelves up there in between our normal stuff. <laughs> 
I decorated down here a little bit in between our normal stuff. I put some greenery down in here. Diego's wearing his Santa hat. I got winter tree back there with some snowmen, but down there, and I got a little gathering of Santas here with different flags, and then some snowmen down here, and some greenery by a picture there. And then I got my polar bear, snowman, little critter village scene. But it's mostly polar bears. What a surprise. And then we got our Santa up here. What kind of Santa is he? I don't know. He looks sort of like the English uh, Father Christmas. That's what I thought too. And then we got the light in the center of the whole square. And so. All right. All right, so the floor is done. Don't step on the cracks. You can you step on the cracks. It's, it's done. <laughs> Crazy woman. Hello, everybody. Hello. What are you doing? Rubbing my ear against your chin. That's not my chin. Your cheek, whatever. Oh, it's my ear you're rubbing. <laughs> oh, we're rubbing ears. <laughs> you're weird. So guys, I hope you enjoyed hanging out with us today. Kevin did some work on the floor, and I got a little bit of cleaning and decorating done. And um, I, I kind of, my, my hand kind of hurts. <laughs> oh, well. So, you know, I, I, I guess you're not supposed to try and uh, twist your wrist with a cast on. That's why you have a cast on, so you can't do that. Hmm. Anyway, we started a new Facebook page today. One that is more user-friendly for everybody. We will put the link in the description below. Um, it probably will not be clickable, but if it's not, just copy and paste it. Also, if you're working from a laptop, over on the right-hand side, there's little clickable links. That is the correct Facebook now. So if you click on that link, it will take you to the correct Facebook. So go ahead and send us a Facebook friend request, and um, we will uh, accept your friendship, and we will get this Facebook thing up and running so Groovy man. Uh, the other thing is is you have 12 days left to get your limited edition meowy christmas boomer t-shirt so don't miss out on that and that's about it so if you enjoyed kevin fixing the toilet finishing the kitchen floor and me doing a little bit of cleaning and decorating please give us a great big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, press that little red subscribe button down below and become a member of the neighborhood community because we do have an awesome community. And share this video with your family and friends and we will see you guys all tomorrow. Bye. Bye.